the buzz of the Manchester derby is upon us. Songs from both sides echo throughout the streets as the noisy neighbours prepare to go head to head in what's set to be a brilliant display of football. Stay with us on EA TV for the live action as it happens. It is a city divided, red versus blue, United versus City, and we're just moments away from kickoff time here at the Theatre of Dreams. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And I'll tell you what, Stuart, what an encounter this promises to be. Well, I can't wait for this one, Derek. These are two massive clubs full of top-class players, and the atmosphere inside this stadium is electric. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Jack Grealish in the wide positions. And lining up through the middle in attack today, Erling Haaland. Danger averted. A look at the table then, and for Tottenham, I think you can make a coherent case that they haven't really been playing up to bar. Well, it's certainly not what I was expecting. I thought they'd be in a Champions League position at this point, but they look short on confidence, aren't playing as a team, and there's been a shortage of quality. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Walker. Well, good effective pressure. Delphine. Stones. Vandiol. Grealish. The ball with Rodri. Regain possession. of advantage in United's favour. Well, it's always a great thrill to watch Erling Haaland in action. He can be absolutely unstoppable, and we should expect that he'll have a prominent role to play in this one, Stuart. Well, how can you stop him? If you get too tight, he'll use the space behind you, drop off, and he'll turn and run at you. Add that to his movement in the box, and you can see why he scored so many goals. Bruno Fernandes has it. Going well. Dallo. So City get things going again, and the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Manchester United kick the ball, advantage. Lisandro Martinez. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Throw in here for United. 
Sufyan Amrabat. And the defensive intervention there. Almost at half time, and Manchester City facing a deficit. Stewart interested to get your take as regards their first half performance. Well, it stopped a promising attack in its tracks, and you wouldn't be surprised if there's a card coming out here. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right, he knew what he was doing there. Short with the clearance. Now oh, Frank's over for now. Playing advantage here. United keep it. Can he find the right pass? Good vision. Can he get onto this? Corner to United as they look to extend the lead. Can someone get on the end of this? Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Diogo Dallo. Dallo. Back to Fernandes. Anthony. Now Casemiro. Save in the end. Well, the short corner routine. Well, the and so the first half story has been written. Half time here at Old Trapper. Well, part of the story here, ending Holland's struggling. Second half underway, with United looking to build upon a largely positive first half showing. Manchester United facing Fulham. And a chance to whip it in here. Under real pressure defensively. Will they pay the price? Oh, good looking run. That is how to keep it out of the net. Here's a change for Manchester United. Over it comes. Rodri. And that is how to block. Jeremy Doku. A really good pass. Cuts it back. Doku. That attempt now never really looked like scoring, did it? Well, this is certainly the home of live football, EA TV, and looking forward to bringing you more action from the Premier League. It's Manchester oh, City. This is a big moment here. And it's gone in just what was needed for Manchester City, who now have squared it.
Well, just watch this again. It's a really good goal, but it's no surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. Well, disappointment, anger, frustration, whatever is going through his mind, he needs to get his team going again here. So back underway, following the equaliser. Maguire. Diogo Dallo on the ball. Casemiro. Jack Grealish. And it's Ruben Diaz. 20 minutes remaining. <laughs> Sofian Amrabat. <laughs> Given away by Manchester United. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. Goal for Manchester well, a dramatic City. moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Sofian Amrabat. And in the right position to make sure it didn't go all the way through. Stones. Gvardiol. And now Stones. Ten minutes to go then. De Bruyne. Well, City are almost there. Not quite. They can't celebrate just yet. Stuart, what have you made of their performance in this match? Well, they should have had this wrapped up long ago. Some of their football has been excellent. But they're going to need to be resilient in these final few minutes to get their much-deserved victory. And a useful cross. But keeper's ball. They'll be disappointed with that delivery. Got McTominay. United regaining possession. Diogo Dallo. Christian Eriksen now. Manchester United battling the clock and the scoreline. But they took care of the situation defensively. Will he play it in? Well, if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. And time for the change now. Sofian Amrabat. And a significant block following that cross. And so the referee blows the whistle. It is the end of the contest. And the three points go to Manchester City. Well, Derek, it was a tight game. Both sides had their moments and chances, but overall, they just about shaded it. A well-earned victory. Well, it truly was a terrific performance by Erling Haaland, really lighting up this game. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat, and he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was.